The Personalized Privacy Assistant project is about the development of technologies that will help users regain control over their privacy in mobile and IoT environments. Increasingly, as we interact with different technologies during the course of our daily lives, we're dealing with a number of different processes that collect data about us and use it for a variety of different purposes. It is unrealistic to expect users to read all the privacy policies associated with these technologies, let alone configure settings that these technologies may or may not be making available to us. Instead, we're building an infrastructure that will enable resource owners to declare the presence of their resources in different spaces, along with the privacy practices associated with these resources, what data they collect, for what purpose, how long they retain that data, to what extent they aggregate or anonymize that data, and to what extent they have settings that they're willing to make available to users. Along with this technology, we're building privacy assistance that will reside on people's mobile phones initially, and that will enable users as they roam around to discover relevant registries, query these registries, and find out about resources deployed in these spaces that are collecting data about them. We don't want to overwhelm them with a number of notifications. Instead, a big part of this project involves building models through machine learning that will help us customize these interactions. We want users to only be notified about those things that they care about or that they might be surprised about, and we don't want to overwhelm them with warnings every five seconds, letting them know about another sensor that they already expect to be present. We've been very successful already with the deployment of these technologies in the context of mobile applications, where we've piloted this technology with a meaningful set of users, showing that we can automatically configure many settings on their behalf. And now we're starting to experiment with the same technology in an IoT context, with users entering buildings, discovering resources, and semi-automatically configure settings that are potentially made available to them by the various resources collecting data about them in these environments.